Hey, what's up everybody? Um, if you have an iPhone, then you know that the SMS tones are pretty basic. There's only six options. Go ahead and show you real quick. As you can see here, there's only six options. Um, but if you want to change one of these or all of them, it's pretty easy. So I'm going to show you how to do that today. What you'll need before we get started is a jailbroken iPhone. Uh, iPhone 3G or iPhone 3GS works for any of them as long as it's jailbroken also you will need a uh, program to SSH into your iPhone I recommend disk aid it's the easiest to use um, you can just Google search disk aid and um, it'll come up as the first option and you will also need a program called uh, switch and this will allow you to convert uh, media files easily well uh, audio files easily and you'll need iTunes or a different type of software where you can edit uh, your audio so let's go ahead and switch over to the computer now the screen capture and we'll get to work alright so we're over here on the screen uh, first we want to go into iTunes go through your library or wherever you have your music files select the one you, that you want to use as your SMS tone now the thing is the reason why you need uh, audio editing software or iTunes is because you have to go in um, say I want to use this song right here by Gym Class Heroes um, you want to go into get info go into options and you want to select about two to five seconds no longer than five seconds because uh, if you choose the whole song as your SMS tone it will play the entire song even after you read the SMS close the SMS app or I should say messages app um, even if you put your phone to sleep after you read your message it'll still play the entire song until it finishes so you want to choose between two and five second clips from your songs and I chose uh, this little clip from one a minute and seven seconds to a, a little over a minute and nine seconds so I'm just gonna play it for you real quick this is what it sounds like and that's it so that's the little clip just for an example if I were if I wanted to use that as my SMS tone so once you do that you want to right click it again and go to create AAC version now this will make a small version see here it's uh, about three seconds long and you just want to drag that to your desktop now the original version you want to go back into get info options and unclick the start and stop time so it'll go back to the normal settings press ok done with iTunes for now close that down go into switch have it up right here you want to drag this file into switch and then output format you want to use dot AIFF and choose your output folder I'm using the desktop as usual when I do tutorials because it makes it easier to access the files uh, quicker and once you do that you just click convert it'll quickly convert the file to AIFF as you see here now what you want to do switch back to the, the iPhone the SMS tones are numbered so tritone is 1, chime is 2, glass is 3, horn is 4, bell is 5, electronic is 6 so you want to choose which one you want to change so let's say we want to change chime we're going to change that so it's number two so back to the computer you want to change the file name to SMS received to dot CAF now you notice that I changed it to CAF from AIFF and there's a reason to this that we'll get into when we open up disk aid so once you have that done you click anywhere on the desktop and it'll come up with a uh, pop-up asking you if you want to if you're sure you want to change the file name you click yes and it'll change to a CAF file now 
you want to go into disk aid so we can minimize switch for now go into disk aid and of course your iPhone has to be connected through USB to your computer go into disk aid and make sure you're in the root folder down at the bottom left hand corner make sure you're in the root folder which I already am so once you are you go down to system you go to the library and let it load all the contents okay and then you want to go into audio UI sounds open that folder up and these are all the different UI sounds user interface sounds that you uh, hear when you do certain things on your iPhone so we're going to go to SMS received you can see the six files right here so this is the tone this is the chime this is the glass this is the horn the bell and electronic now we change the ch we're, we're, we want to change the chime sound so we're going to go to the CAF2 file which is the chime and rename that one to BAK dot BAK just click OK and then we're just gonna drag the CAF file that we made onto that folder so then scroll down and here you can see we have the 2.caf and the 2.bak so that's pretty much it so we're going to respring the phone so we're gonna go in here okay we're gonna As you can see, the chime tone is now changed to that Gym Class Hero snippet that we chose. So I'm going to go into my messages and text myself, test, close out of it, just to prove that it works. And as you can see right there, everything worked out perfect. So there you see, test and test, sent it and received it right away, no problems, and the sound worked, and I think I kind of like that um, little snippet as my SMS, so I might, change, I might uh, keep that for a while until I find some other part of a song that I like more, so yep, that's pretty much it, hope this helped, until next time, don't forget to comment, rate, subscribe, peace.